Hey guys, I just uploaded the seventh episode of the timeline series titled The Rest of the Story on the Case of Christopher Watts. Number seven is titled Conflict and Chaos. And I just uploaded the Patreon version onto the Patreon channel. So, the Cliff's Notes version is, in my opinion, I think that Christopher Watts' wife knew conflict and chaos. I think she knew how to thrive in conflict and chaos. And I think Christopher Watts was the opposite. I don't think he had a clue when he met her that people would ever lie about their health, about their finances, about anything. I don't think he knew that people would talk about people behind their backs or to their faces. I think when his wife was rude to his friends, that he honestly did believe she was just having a bad day. And he never took the time to count how many bad days she was having. I think she needed to have conflict and chaos. I think that's what people do when they're not being honest with others or even with themselves. I also addressed the issue of whether or not she actually had any friends. I'm not talking about MLM friends. I'm talking about friends in real life. I'm talking about the fact that she said that she lost all of her friends because of her health challenges, but that was okay because she made new friends online. I don't think she lost all of her friends because I don't think she had any friends to lose. And I think this is one of the reasons, only one of the reasons that she was desperate to get out of North Carolina. I don't think she knew how to engage with Christopher Watts' family or his friends because she was used to conflict and chaos. I think she wanted to be more like his family and friends, but I don't think she knew how. <laughs> 